there's no rant. There's no story. Well, actually, there is kind of a rant. Um, I just don't appreciate when people try to think they're going to use me just to promote their own clips. Like the girl that uh, sucks on cucumbers and shit. She, um, like, I was like, okay, she about to make her some coins. She about to make her OnlyFans. She DM'd me one time on Twitter and said, hey, can you retweet this for me? Um, and then she was, like, having a conversation. She was like, could you give me, like, uh, the free trial on OnlyFans? I'll send you money or whatever. I just need to learn what kind of videos to do. But I was like, mm, no. But I will tell you, if you shoot content with different, like, male porn stars... You can probably build your brand faster than, you know, just whatever you're doing right now. Because I don't know if the fan base you're building right now is going to be willing to subscribe to whatever you got going on. Um, then today, I post a dick sucking clip. She posts a dick sucking clip under my dick sucking clip and says, hashtag twinning. Bitch, you got me fucked up. Just because we both put dicks in our mouth don't mean we twinning on any kind of level. Like, ma'am. No. No, 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 and you been have my number for the longest, still haven't hit it or anything. You say you want to do clips. No, you're not about to leech off my fan base. No, mm -mm. Mm -mm. I think the fuck not. Blocked her ass with the quickness, got me fucked up. And unfollowed her on here, got me fucked up. Bitch, it took me two and a half years to build my fan base. And all you had to do was suck a motherfucking cucumber and get Boosie to repost your shit. No. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Nope. Uh-uh. She tried to do the same shit with, uh, with Tiana. And Tiana was like, man, you see none of my fans are tagging me in it. Because she tried to do something like, who has the better throat, me or Tiana? Or that she's the official head doctor or something. Tag Tiana. And nobody was tagging Tiana. They're like, bitch, really? You really think you that good? That good. Okay. Mm-hmm. You know how many dicks me and Tiana had to suck to get where we were <laughs> A lot. That's the answer. I'm not going to France. Yes, I'm eating again. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I've had clients that find me from Ruben, too. Like, some, some of the clients that see me for a private, they first see me on YouTube. I'm like, oh, that's lit. No, I'm not going to Virginia. Oh, my God. My favorite food. Oh, no. I've been in the mood for, like, seafood and Thai food lately. So, the spicy Thai mussels. Oh, my God. The spicy Thai mussels are really good. No, I just shit a lot. And I do a lot of anal. So, yeah, helps push everything out. Everything's very well regulated, you know? Just never constipated. Oh, you love my OnlyFans? Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to work on getting some rim job videos. It's just a lot of men are not secure in their masculinity, so they won't let me eat their booty. So, I'm sorry. Uh. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, mm, mm. TMI? That's not TMI. You are on a porn star's page. What did you expect? You want me to be holier than thou? Nope. Mm. <laughs> Keep that shit going. Thank you. I've done it. You haven't seen my dick trainer scenes, though. I was like, blah, 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 blah. I made him my bitch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, this is quesadilla shit. Oh, my God. I'm full. I'm, like, really full. Mm. Mm. 
Mm, mm, mm. I wouldn't say I have exes that are obsessed with me because I I didn't always suck dick the way I suck dick. Believe it or not. Oh my god. That shit was wonderful. I need to make sure my whole like vagina is not out. Oh my god. That shit was beautiful. Oh, Woo. that shit. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Real men get their ass ate, period, poo. Period, poo. That's that king mentality. went to school i didn't like it fuck that shit i did not like it Mm-mm. that instead of wasting 12 years of my life they could have taught me lifelong skills that i didn't need to go to college for and i could have just worked a regular entry-level job work my way up been content with that now i'm over here just you know sucking dick you know and i've gotten better over the years and it's really paying off so not all skills need to be taught they could have gave us a little information pamphlet about building credit they could have uh gave us different shit about like financial advice as far as loans and appreciation uh, like uh the fucking aprs all that bullshit that you're supposed to learn how to do and just be smart with your money and learn how to budget and all this bullshit that just equates to adulting. Ah, No one ever taught me this. I'm learning. I should have been had a CD opened up. Oh my God. I should have been had one like three years ago. But no one told me about this. No one told me about this. I'm learning on my own. They never do. I feel like I should just have a, a a school just for home ec, you know, how to make $20 last a week. Hello? Actually, I don't even want to see, like, in 60 years how little, like, money will do. Like, $100, that's probably going to last you two hours in 60 years because they're going to make everything more expensive. Mm-mm. 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 And then people dumbass is going to be paying the same car loan instead of getting it refinanced. They're just going to pay the same shit for five years and then pay basically for a whole other car when all they need to do is refinance and see if they can refinance like two or three. And that will just cut down that loan so fucking much. So instead of like twelve to $16,000 worth of interest, you'll be paying like anywhere from two to four. What's up? What's up? Financial freedom. (sighs) Yes, I got, yeah, I got refinanced. And, um, what's it called? Because my Mustang EcoBoost was only 21,000, but I never built credit. So I was like, okay, fuck, instead of buying it, I'm just going to refinance it. And then probably trade it towards the end of the loan. So then that way I keep just building my loan history. Or not loan history, but my credit history. Um, What's it called? Refinancing it is going to cut 12000 off of it. And then it's cutting my car note like down by $200. Mm, mm, mm.
Period. Pooh, tell them, Demarcus. Tell them. My original one, I think they said it was like 18. 18, I think. And now it's going to be like six or seven. School does suck. Mm, 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 mm. Your lunch is twenty dollars a day. Uh uh-uh. uh. You better get some cup ramen and ask one of the teachers in the uh, little teachers lounge if they could pour some of that hot water in there. You got the game fucked up. And then bring, bring some pre cooked shrimp. Throw that shit in there or some shredded up chicken. I'll fuck no. But you need to figure it out because that shit is expensive. Those quesadillas. Oh, I got those from the frozen uh, food section. And that shit is gonna be like a good two or three meals. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, you about to be a whole ass lawyer in eight months. Hey. <clears throat> the only thing I splurge on is my little mimosas. I get my little corbel. I get my simply because, you know, Tropicana tastes like ass. Um, and surprisingly, that I don't like that kind of ass taste. That's like a, the raunchy, funky, unwashed, mildewy ass. Um, simply is like, you know, freshly shaved, freshly bleached. If you don't want that discoloration. Like, it's like the Mike Adriano of asses, you know, like one tone, like just freshly clean. You even suck a finger in, make sure that shit's fresh. Maybe a little tart from the bleach. You know? <laughs> oh, but yeah, Simply. I love Simply. It's amazing. Mm. I think we all got issues. We all do. Popeye's chicken sandwich two for eight. Stop playing. I've not even had one. I don't even know what the hype is around a chicken sandwich. I don't have a favorite porn star. You wild and I love it. Mike is a real one. Thank you. No, I don't have them pierced. I haven't had them pierced for like a good year. Love when you go live. Thank you. Thank you. I switched back to a business profile because I was just tired of having people send me email inquiries and shit. And I'm like, bruh, leave me alone. So I had to switch back. I'm just like, I don't care if I can't see how many profile views or whatever. I don't care. Um, I'm ha- I am having a great day. I just ate. I'm probably going to have a couple mimosas, watch Roots, cry myself to sleep. Because I read the book. I just wanted to uh, watch the little series. But they said season one. But they was mentioning. uh, They was mentioning Kunta Kinte's daughter and shit. And in the fourth episode. uh, And I'm like. Is it really going to stop there? Is there only one season of Roots? Is there only one season? Is there only four episodes? I'm asking a serious question. I'm trying to find out if there's more than one season of Roots. Because that's going to be my Labor Day weekend plans. Did you watch the original? No, nigga. I just see it on Hulu and I'm trying to watch it. There's... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They only got one season on Hulu. Wow. Wow. I'm not sending you my Addy. I'll just go buy the shit on Amazon. I'm good. Wait. So there's... Okay. I need y'all to answer this question. I live in California. I need y'all to answer this question. So the the series that I'm seeing on Hulu, there's only four episodes, but there's multiple seasons or 
or no, there's only four episodes and just one season. There's only one season or there's more than one season. Just no, I don't fire stick, but I don't want to steal from people. I'm not trying to steal from people. They using somebody else's credit cards. And I already had the shit go down where somebody was trying to use my uh, Venmo and shit. Uh Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Nope. Nope. Okay. 